Hello, this is Andrew from Yurkai, and today we're going to talk about the Yurkai Clydesdale electric model, which we have installed on the Backfeeds.nl, one of our most popular cargo bikes. Yeah, so our Dutch bikes and cargo bikes are really well suited for the electrification, um, both because they're strong enough and they can also handle the torque, and that's why we use really, really strong wheel builds and, you know, high quality tires as well. Um, so just a little bit about the system. So electrification is just an amazing thing to add on to your um, existing Dutch bike or cargo bike. So this Clydesdale is one of the strongest motors that we can legally put on in Canada because it's 500 watts. And it also gives you an amazing 80 newton meters of torque. That's a lot of torque. And in addition to that, because this is a mid-drive, it actually leverages your internal hub. Um, gearing. So that gives you an amazing amount of torque which allows you to climb some very steep hills um, even laden down with uh, cargo um, and so it's a really nice it's a really nice feature for the bike. It also is great just in normal everyday use throughout the city if you don't have any big hills it just allows you to get to work without perspiring. Um, it also gets you there a little bit faster and it really greatly extends your radius. Depending on the battery you choose, you can get anywhere from 20 to almost 100 kilometers on a, on a charge. So what you may have thought was possible before, this is gonna, will really, literally blow your mind. So we've coined these before as the SUV of bicycles. You add on an electrification kit like this Clydesdale and it, it just, it goes beyond what you can expect uh, a bike, before what you could expect a bike to be able to do and what you can carry. So amazing. So a little bit about the system. So I talked a little bit earlier about it's a mid-drive. Um, so again, that leverages the gears in the back, which also makes it more efficient. So as you start off in the lower gear, um, it takes less power for that motor to move you. And then you move up as you increase your speeds. The other thing that's nice is everything's in your control. So we can program this to allow it to ride and help you the way you want to be helped. Um, for example, if you want to pedal less and get more power, or only give more power when you pedal more. Um, other things are just in terms of you can have different variations or levels of support. So from one to nine, or one to five, or one to three, depending how you're using it. So, and including off. So that's an important distinction as well. So if you just turn the system off, it's basically like your bike you had before. Um, and then when you start on one, then the motor will kick in. So it's really nice. You don't have to ever be worried about not being able to use your bike if you happen to not charge your battery or something like that. It's always still gonna be your regular bike. Um, so in terms of the level of assist, uh, one is going to feel like a, a light help um, and then when you go to the maximum of whatever your setting is um, you have to legally be turning the cranks for the pedal assist um, for it to engage the motor but you won't be doing much more than that if you do not want to or you can go in the middle where you're kind of giving 50-50. Uh, the other nice thing about the feature of, of this uh, model as well is that it does have a walk assist. You just hold down the button here and the, the motor will give just enough power for you to go walking speed, which is nice if you're fully loaded down with cargo. Uh, the other nice feature of the mid-drive is basically everything else stays the same, so you still have your dynamo lighting uh, up front if you, on many of our Dutch bikes and cargo bikes that's already um, on there, so that everything else stays the same. It's just the mid-drive itself. Um, uh, changes the bottom bracket here. Um, the other nice thing, some of the nice upgrades we do, for example, on this one, we use a stainless steel chain, stainless steel so it doesn't rust. Um, and so that adds to, again, the longevity of the bike because adding a uh, mid-drive motor will add, obviously, a lot more torque um, onto uh, your hub and your chain. So you want to make sure you have a really high quality chain to be able to take that additional load. So, and just in terms of this bike in, in particular, um, this has been spec'd up for a customer, so it's got some great features. It has the second removable bench for a third child with the uh, safety belt. Uh, you also have um, the cupboard underneath the bench, um, the first bench, which is great for storing things and locking it up when you need to leave. And they also have the new canopies, which came out this year, are the extra large canopies. So they're actually higher than the existing ones, as well as having side vents. And these ones are great um, as your children get older or if they're just taller, gives you a little bit more room in the, uh, in the box there. So without further ado, let's get riding. So another feature I forgot to mention before was the e-brake cutoffs. So the minute you touch your brakes, it automatically kicks out the motor for safety. You can tell now cruising around 25 and not doing too much work at all. The starts are just amazing.
So if you'd like to know more information about our electrification kits, please uh, send us an email at hello at yurkai.com or you can visit our website at yurkai.com.